referee's going to give him some time to recover. And that is why we rear air protection, guys. It really is difficult to recover from one of these shots, guys. You never really know how long it's going to take. But it looks like Pat is ready to continue. Get right back to the action. Nice counter right hand by Pat as his opponent was moving in. Goes for the takedown. Let's see if he ends up on top. And he does. Able to keep his opponent down for the meanwhile. Let's see if he can advance his position. And he can. Moves into the side control position here as he allows himself to go back into the half guard. As they scramble up to the feet, Pat still has control over one leg. Goes for the body lock. See if he can finish. Ends up on top again. Nicely executed takedowns to end up in the top control position again. Top domination by the Australian athlete here. Trying to soften up his opponent to, to create some openings, hopefully for a submission or some further ground and pound. Good advancement of the position by Pat here, has this control position, looking to take the back here, forcing his opponent to give up the turtle. Quick sink in there with the rear naked choke. Let's see if he can get the right angle before the time runs out. Doesn't, chooses to go for strikes. And the arm bar. It looks like he's gonna run out of time, but he gets the bend on the arm. Time out, just in time. Saved by the bell, as they say. I think it's safe to say that the Australian athlete got the edge in that round. Multiple takedowns, multiple submission attempts, accurate ground and pound strikes. Let's see how the let's see how Irasquin from Curacao comes out in this second round, knowing that he's behind one round. Gonna try and push the striking here. Oh, nice connection there with the right hand, but no follow up. So Pat able to continue to pressure and search for, search for that strike and then take down, which he implemented so well in the first round.
good exchange of strikes by both athletes. Outside reap there by Pat, nicely taken down there to go straight into the mount. Not the best position for Barry to be in, in Curacao. Pat is searching for that arm triangle. Let's see if he can hit it from the top position. Quite difficult from there. He's going to have to come off to the side here. Depending on the angle here. And he gets the tap. And it's a very, very technical finish from the Australian fighter. Arm triangle. Beautiful work. All round. All round showcase of uh, a, a full rounded MMA game. From strikes to takedowns to control to submission. Excellent job by Pat Hill from Australia.